guys, good morning. Coach hey, Sean, gypsyrevolution.com, and we're bringing you week two Yay. day. Ocho, shift shot, speed. Three, five. Three, five. So you got three markers today in three different sequences. I've never done it, so I can give you advice. That, that, that's it, that's, that's all you got. I don't know, we'll see how it goes. Um, hopefully well, hopefully before the baby wakes up. Oh, what do you got? And we'll talk to you at the end. Yeah, sounds good. It's a good idea. All right, guys, we made it. We just literally got done stretching, so it's 35 minute workout and a five minute stretch. And I burned 580 calories in that amount of time using my Polar Heart Rate Monitor connected to my Apple Watch. Whoa. Woo. Um, well then, I've always said that you can get a good workout in a short amount of time if you're pushing yourself. So, D25. I said, if you're really down in the mood, if you're really pushing yourself, you would get a good workout. And you did. You, did. you burned a bunch of calories, you got a bunch of sweat. This, entirely new level than that. This, um, for two reasons. One, it's longer, a little bit. Um, and then the moves are more complex. So, for those of you that have trouble with rhythm, coordination, modifying, it's a little bit challenging to get the hang of yeah. what you're supposed to do. Even someone like me who's naturally gifted at most things, I, I had a little bit of trouble getting the, the not the coordination, because I knew what we were doing, but like the rhythm mm -hmm. to it, because there's a lot of like rhythm, like the diamond thing. It's simple. If I had a ladder, it would have been very easy. But because there wasn't a ladder, it was hard to me conceptualize. So it was like you had to time it and the pattern, and, and, and it felt awkward. But once you get the rhythm down, right, like boom, 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 then it's easy. And it's supposed to feel awkward, I think. You know, yeah. you're supposed to kind of challenge yourself not to just do plank walks across, you know, across. You have to do some sort of rhythm to mix it up a little, otherwise you get stagnant in it. Yeah, the plank walk was interesting. I messed up the first time. You were supposed to go up over the blue, mm -hmm. out, down in the middle, across, up over the next color, out, and then you keep yeah. doing that. And if you can't, just do the plank walk. But you know what I mean? like. His modified version is going on your knees and tapping, so it would be the next level up from that would just be doing a straight plank walk mm -hmm. down and plank walk out if you can't stay in the little crazy pattern. But um, but again, with this, we're saying like it was a little complicated. It, it's you can make it simple, so don't think like oh it's too complex. I can't do it. Nah, just roll it back a bit, and you know if you can't do the diamond thing, just go. In, in, out, out, mm -hmm. in, in, out, out. Don't even go back and forth. Don't get crazy with it. Just keep it simple, stupid, and just go, move. Yeah, keep, you know, keep your heart rate up. Keep trying the best you can. Um, our living room was a little small. I think also to stay on camera, like for both of us. So I did push away my markers at one point. So mm -hmm. you'll probably see me doing this without the markers because we kept running into each other. And I'm like, you know what, screw it. I'm gonna use this part of the floor and I'm gonna focus and I don't wanna hit him because that's gonna hurt one of us more than I just stay in my own little zone. And then some of the moves we made even bigger. Yeah. So we used the whole living room and we just chased each other around. Well, I was thinking about that actually. Which is kind of nice. Week with speed 35, not 25, but 35, I think we could almost share the marker. If we're doing it right. Yeah. yeah. We got to make sure to know which pause. dot to start on and who's the chaser, who's the chasey, that kind of thing. That'd be fun. But um, yeah, so you do 35 minutes, you do two. Blocks. Different formations. Two blocks. So when he calls it a formation, you put your markers in a triangle shape for the first set, 
and you do all these moves and then you do them for a minute a piece and then you do them again for 30, 30 seconds. seconds and then you do another block block of moves and you put your um, Dots markers straight. in a line and then you do those moves for a minute and then you do them again for 30 seconds and then a line of those 45 seconds just man these dudes it's like it's like mountain climbers and you just come up yeah. and boom they call them he's like you Spider go through like <coughs> things call them. Yeah. it's a crazy face but yeah that's the ins and outs of secrets so shh tell your friends tell everybody join us in the shop all right, so that that that's that you explained it all. Sorry. I got nothing. I'm I've got nothing. I'll just be the pretty face on camera afterwards. All right, guys, that was day one of week two, and we are almost halfway through. Yeah, almost two more days. We're halfway. Okay. So that's it. Can um, figure out what I'm allowed to have breakfast. <laughs> email us info at gf2revolution.com. We can help you guys come join our challenge group and uh, get incorporated and get incorporated. Don't get incorporated. You know, even though unless you got a patent or some business going on, get incorporated. That sounds get good. Get involved. And uh, yeah. Happy day one to our challengers. Yeah, we got a group starting today with corporate and everything. Yeah, Chris Downing is going to do the workout along with us, give motivational videos and all that good stuff. But it's time to go.